Being with Jen makes me feel a sense of security. I can completely be myself around her. She understands my humor, which probably makes no sense for people. At first, when I met Gabriel, I thought he was a very playful person. Like, he's never serious. When I got to know him a lot better, I think what struck me the most was his kind-heartedness. He's just so naturally respectful to everybody around him in whatever he do, and I was just taken aback. You know how now in society when we date someone, it's always that push and pull game, which is quite tiring. But with her, I can just be completely confident that she's there. In our angriest moments, when we are extremely frustrated with each other, I still wanted to be with him. That's how you realise that love is a decision and it's not just a feeling. She has always been such a strong pillar of support throughout my life and I deeply appreciate every single part of her. To me, he's really not just a partner, he's also my best friend. When I had to visualise spending the rest of our lives together, it wasn't a very difficult thing to think about at all. I, Gabriel, take you, Genesis, to be my wife. I, Genesis, take you, Gabriel, to be my husband. I promise to be true to you in the good times and in bad, in sickness and in health. I will love you and honour you all the days of my life. Take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. This is where Dear Jen, thank you for being such a gem. I am really, really lucky to have you as a spouse. Dear Gabe, thank you for being my number one cheerleader. You never fail to remind me of my strengths and you always have the utmost faith in me in whatever I do. We have pushed each other to be better versions of ourselves and now we get to do this for a lifetime. It's funny how we didn't hit it off well in the beginning. I remember judging her poorly because she looked a little alien and had lots of ear piercings. However, after becoming friends, we realised that her RBF is just her staring into blank space or thinking really hard about something. Give you're like a brother that I never had. You, me, Mike will always be the three drunkards. But maybe a promotion to the three fathers down the line. My only first impression of him was always annoying people. He wears pretentious Harry Potter spectacles and he takes photos. And I have to say that it was a pretty accurate first impression, except now he's also mini Harry Styles. Have you guys seen his outfit today? Step out. But I was pleasantly surprised because he was such a man of manners. Always so thoughtful and courteous to everyone around him. And I remember thinking to myself that this guy is a keeper. I just didn't expect that I really got to keep him for life. Jen, your patience is like no other. I'm able to be my goofy self in front of you. You are the reason the world is a better place to live in. And I hope I can do the same for you.
Lord, in times of need, may we find comfort in your embrace, and in your presence, may we find abundant joy, peace, and contentment. Help us continue this journey together as husband and wife, and continue spreading love to people around us too. Amen.